Brain tech, yeah, where tech is made simple. So if you have been unable to upgrade to Windows 11, be it version 21H2 or version 22H2, and your device does meet the system requirements for Windows 11, um, there could be an Intel issue regarding um, your Intel SST audio drivers if you are running an Intel-based system and device. Now, this is because recently on the 22nd of September, just a couple of days ago, Microsoft has updated their known issues for Windows 11, um, where they have mentioned that Intel and Microsoft have found incompatibility issues with certain versions of drivers for the Intel Smart Sound technology. That's the Intel SST audio drivers on Intel 11th Gen Core processors on Windows 11. And that's exactly what I'm running on this device. I'm running an Intel 11th Gen Core processor, and I'm also using um, Intel SST audio drivers for some of my hardware. Now, um, their reason for the compatibility hold is they say that Windows 11 devices with the affected Intel SST audio driver might receive an error with a blue screen. So that's the dreaded blue screen of death. And obviously, that means the system could crash. So that's why they've placed a safeguard hold and a compatibility hold on devices with an Intel 11th Gen Core processor and Intel SST audio drivers. And um, if you are affected by this, um, the easiest would be just to double check your driver version as the compatibility hold has been placed on devices with outdated Intel SST audio drivers. So to do this, um, I would suggest just right clicking on your start menu and then you would have to click on your device manager. And I would also suggest in device manager, just um, show hidden devices, which will give you a list of all the devices and hardware on your system and then head over to sound video and game controllers and expand that and yeah you'll see intel smart sound technology for bluetooth digital microphones usb audio and so on and then just double click on any of those intel smart sound technology devices click on the driver tab and yeah you'll see your driver version now microsoft is saying that if you have a driver version of 10.29.0.5152 or 10.30.0.5152 or later, so that's older, an outdated version, then that's why your there is a compatibility hold on your device and you are not receiving Windows 11 because those drivers are causing, those outdated drivers are now causing the blue screen of death and those errors. And as you can see, my driver version is a newer version, 10.29.0.7652. So obviously the... Um, the fix and the workaround here would be to make sure that you update the driver to a newer version like I have in my case. And this also, um, the updated driver also depends on your PC manufacturer. So you also may have to check for updates on your PC manufacturer, your OEMs, that's your original equipment manufacturer's website. Or as um, I would also suggest, first of all, is just to head over to your Windows Update advanced options, optional updates, and check if the, any of those drivers are listed here under optional updates, and then just install those newer versions of those drivers. And then um, according to Microsoft, when you do update those Intel um, SST audio drivers to a newer version, um, basically um, you should then be able to upgrade to Windows 11, be it version 21H2 or version 22h2 which is the most recent feature update for windows 11 and also also they also they say that the safeguard hold could take 48 hours to lift even after upgrading um, to a newer version of the driver so uh, just take note that um you might not receive the um the update um, straight away after updating to a newer version you might have to wait for 48 hours now they also recommend that if you are not seeing windows um 11 uh, the upgrade um, um, even if uh, your hardware meets these system requirements um, and you are running an Intel 11th gen core processor and those Intel SST audio drivers um, they do suggest not to um, try and force the update by using um, the Windows 11 installation assistant or the media creation tool because obviously as I say that safeguard hold is in place to protect your device and your upgrade experience and the affected platforms, as mentioned, are version 21H2 and version 22H2. So if you are affected, just go upgrade those Intel SST audio drivers to newer versions. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.